In this video lecture, I am going to find the value of k for the root of equation kx bracket x minus 2 root 5 plus 10 equal to 0 real and equal. So let's see the answer. So writing the given equation first kx after that x minus 2 root 5 plus 10 equal to 0. So this kx multiplying with this all. So this here kx square. The next is minus 2 root 5 kx. Then after plus 10 equal to 0. Now this I am going to compare with the general form of quadratic equation. So here ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0. Now the next is here you can identify a, a is k, b equal to minus 2 root 5 k and c equal to 0. After that for, for real and equal root, for real and equal roots d equal to 0 d is now b square minus 4 ac equal to 0 so b value is now minus 2 root 5 k whole square minus 4 into a value is k c value c value is 10 here 10 equal to 0. Now the next is minus minus uh, minus square that is plus here 2 square 4. So 4 and root 5 square 5 into k k square k and this here 40 k equal to 0. So let's write here 20k square minus 40k equal to 0. Now taking the common 20k. So this here k minus 2 equal to 0. So here 20k equal to 0. k minus 2 equal to 0. So k equal to 0 divided by 20. k equal to 0. And here k equal to 0. This moving on the right. So 0 plus 2. k equal to 2. Ok. So k equal to 0 and k equal to 2. Now the next thing is. So here this equation a cannot be 0. If a equal to 0, then a value is 0. So 0 into x square plus bx plus c equal to 0. Okay, so 0, so this here it form bx plus c equal to 0. So this is not a quadratic equation. So that a coefficient of x square not equal to 0. So that here we can write k not equal to 0 our answer is k equal to 2. So to form the quadratic equation a cannot be 0. Coefficient of x square cannot be 0. So that here k cannot be 0. This place 2. So this is the way we can find the root of this quadratic equation. So now in this video it's over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.